there's all to play for. Everything that you do, where any hunch that maybe there's a missed opportunity here, you're probably right. My name's Leo Raymond. I'm the founder of a company called Eden Lab. And that the whole point of Eden Lab is to help companies big and small really help drive the transition to a net zero economy or even a post-carbon economy if we can get there. It's one where we can really live in harmony with nature and with each other. That's why I set myself this goal to help remove five megatons of carbon dioxide equivalent from the atmosphere over the next five years. There's too much of a gap between, on the one hand, sustainability professionals and the environmentalist movement, and on the other kind of people who understand about really shaping and driving human aspiration and behavior in a really positive way. We really need to find a way to encourage customer behavior in the right direction rather than shame them to get there. Frankly, having the imagination, the vision to see a different world ahead in the climate movement, there's not enough painting an alternate reality is just kind of kicking the current one. That's not enough. And I think putting your money where your mouth is, there's not enough evidence in companies actually delivering on it and taking action. There's a big gap still between the pledge and the reality. For me, there are things like humility. So the ability to listen to others and be curious about other people's ideas is, is critical. Imagination, I think, is just vital. I think resourcefulness really is another one because knowing kind of where and how to find the relevant talent you need to crack these problems and how to assemble the right teams which is going to require a real level of resource you know i've certainly felt stretch out of my comfort zone in recent months as i've moved from a safe corporate environment into the creation of a new business that's driving change in a more radical way but what i've really discover is the incredible power of the network around you and the generosity that you give is double back from others and in fact it inspires you to pay it forward as well so i've been really astonished by the power of that network and i think it's very encouraging for everyone don't be afraid to lean into that and to see that people want to help each other out they want to advise they want to support and that is incredibly energizing I've been really lucky to find some awesome allies on this journey. And I have to say, particularly my Cambridge Institute for Sustainability Leadership cohort to create like a ready-made community of people who are pretty active on the WhatsApp group and very supportive. So, but perhaps you'd expect them to be my allies. I think what's been more unexpected are the people who have, and this has really blown me away actually, who have reached out to things I've written on LinkedIn, for example, and offered to help. I asked actually recently, can you help me find uh, some speaking engagement? Because I want to sell this green growth philosophy that I'm a, a big fan of. And what amazed me is the number of people who volunteered to help. And really kind of said, well, I know this person, you could speak to them, you could talk to them. For them to lean in is a, a really amazing sense of allyship. I think there really is a genuine global movement of people trying to make a change here who are sort of putting their energy in the right direction and happy, happy to support people. No one has all the answers for how we deal with the challenge of uh, creating a more sustainable world and, and mitigating climate change. So that means it's all to play for. And that means everything that you do, or any hunch that maybe there's a missed opportunity here, you're probably right. I couldn't overstate the role that CISL played in my story. It gave me a real grounding in the system-wide challenge that we face and really seeing all the different parts and how you have to have an overarching view, a real holistic view to be able to make the changes that we need to make. The course also gave me the confidence, honestly, to back myself and to start my own company. So it had a big impact. It kind of made me leave my old job and start a new one. And lots of people on the course that I've, I've come across are in a similar place. So, you know, it's a catalytic, transformational experience if you treat it that way.